All right, this is our first Lab Out Loud backyard unbox. Looking at a healthy product. If you've ever ordered from Vernier, it should be a telltale sign. This is the quintessential Vernier box. Voila! It reminds me of that episode in Simpsons where they are at the box Extra factory. packaging. I think we got some purchase orders, uh, rebates, mail your warranty, thank you card. We'll throw all that away. And right there it is. Side. And there it is. Look at that. Lab Quest 2. You bet. And, you know, so far, eco friendly packaging. You know what I also like, too? Look at this. When you flip it open. Okay, so. The freedom to inquire. Pull that up a little bit. The technology to excel. That, it just. It just oozes. This is natural, nat, uh, National Poetry Month. Right here, Poetry in Motion. Yeah. Whoa! Notice how there's not like a little tab, like a little like piece of tape underneath here to like, you have to rip open. Yes. You just open it. Okay, so what do we got? We got, uh, well, first of all, we got the lab quest, so let's set that aside. Are there any directions? So got some, uh, then we have the quick start guide, but up here they have the, already they have the first time install the battery, charge your laptop, charge your lab quest. For Quick eight stop. hours total. Yeah, and then, and then turn it on. Start we got, collecting. Uh, we got the battery. That's a nice giant uh, lithium ion battery. Big, huge one. I see Vernier actually makes a, they sell a, an additional battery that you can use as an extra backup. Make sure you recycle that, boys and girls. Yes. And then we got our power charger. Now, uh, will the power, will it, it will just run with power if the battery's dead, like a, like the lab quests, or excuse me, like Logger Pro, or? Um, yeah, I imagine it will. That and we uh, got ourselves a standard USB cable. Got tons of those. And I have so many Andy, Vernier USB cables. Andy, Danny, teeny, tiny. What do you call that? A lanyard. Lanyard, tiny, tiny little lanyard. A LabQuest lanyard. And that's it. Look at this. No styrofoam, eco friendly. Very little plastic. That's good. And up on top is our CD copy of Logger Lite. So you oh, get that right. going. But it'll work with. Uh, um, Logger Pro, Pro too, you, so. but you have to get the update, like 3.8 something. I'll set that aside. So if you have Logger Pro at school, you'll need to update it to work with the LabQuest 2. Okay, here Or is. install the Logger Lite. Let's take the plastic off. Ready? <sighs> Smell the science. <gasps> oh, there. Uh -huh. Okay, so uh, according to the directions, we open it up on the back and... It's got a nice little, little, oh, okay. little flipper there. Flip that open. Is and there anything in there? This? What is this? Oh! This is our stylus. Oh, you can see the stylus, so you can access the stylus from the outside. And then we gotta fire up the battery, but the battery has to charge. So fortunately, Brian has his own battery for one he's already looked at. Cheater. And it's gonna, already charged, we're so we're cheating. We're gonna have a pre-charged battery. And Slap test it in out there. my brand new shiny... Is there anything else on the back? Uh, I don't know. Look at these these little, things. Little feeders. Oh yeah, legs. Little feeders. And uh, the battery lock. This is where you put your little lanyard. Oh, you can set it up like that. Yeah. And so how do we turn tilt. it on? What do we got on top? We got our switches. Why did they choose to rubberize these? Well, I don't that's know. just accessory ports. Look on the side. Accessory Look on the left ports. side. Left side. No, I mean like they're, they're standard Ooh. ports. Channels one, two, and three. Okay. And then uh, U standard USB. What's the USB for? Oh, that's to connect to the computer. I think right. no, it's not. Yeah, it is. Yeah. No, it's not because this would connect to the computer, and the other piece would connect to the lab quest on the other side. So is that to pop on extra space then, or I don't know. Oh yeah, because there's our USB to connect to the computer. There's a USB. This is for the docking stations you can buy for charging them. I saw those. You can buy like a. Uh, you you yeah, can get that and charge five in a row. Sit like yeah. that. That's kind of cool. That is nice. So then, what are these for? These okay, are just so those additional ports. Extra then. ports. Oh, these and the are, digital ports. These are the digital ports. Got it. Okay. And then we have a headphone jack, a microphone jack. And a little tiny micro SD card. So that is an SD card, so you can save data and other stuff there. Save more data on there. So let's turn it on. I haven't played with it yet, and we're just going to power it up and see where it goes and take it from here. Connected Science System. 